Thus began the longest month of my life. Without the ability to access the thrust to weight ratios, my well-intended effort to humiliate a NASA scientist ground to a halt. Mom, what's going on? Something's wrong with Sheldon. <coughs> what's the matter, baby? Have a tummy ache? I think it's an ulcer. Oh. Don't be silly. You must have eaten something. No, my symptoms are consistent with an ulcer. Chelly, remember when you thought you had leprosy and it was just a patch of dry skin? Or when you thought you had gout or an enlarged prostate. Or mad cow. That was my favorite. Well, this is different. Maybe we should take him to the doctor. Listen to your wife. Ulcers are serious. Oh. Well, I've never seen this in someone so young, but uh, your son has an ulcer. Thank you. How could this happen? Uh, there are a number of factors. Has he been under some unusual stress lately? Yes. She won't take me to Radio Shack. We'll wait outside. I've read some interesting research about treating ulcers with antimicrobials. Go! And you're surprised I have an ulcer. I'm surprised I don't have one. <clears throat> um, Radio Shack? He's trying to figure out how to help NASA land rockets. Oh. Well, that's a nice thing. Oh, he's just doing it out of spite. Okay. Uh, well, keep him off spicy foods for the time being, and I'll write you a prescription for Zantac. Does he smoke? Of course not. He's nine. I started at his age, but only when I drank. No. Sheldon, what are you doing? I just need a minute. These things are so slow. Is this your family? They're lovely. Mom. What? There's something wrong with Sheldon again. I figured it out! I figured it out! One night. I want to sleep one night. Oh, hi, Mom. Hi there. With my research complete and my ulcer on the mend, all that was left to do was send my work to NASA and wait to become America's scientific sweetheart. So I waited. And waited. And waited. And waited. Something's wrong with Sheldon again. Now what? Those people at NASA never responded to his science stuff. Damn it. I've had enough of this. Sheldon, get up. What's the point? We're going to Houston. Really? Yeah. You and me are going to give those space monkeys a little talking to. I often found my father to be a strange and puzzling man, but at that moment, I never loved him more. <laughs>